Okay, so hello everyone. Um, I hope you can uh, uh, you can hear me. So um, welcome to uh, Montreal. Let's um, say to, to virtual Montreal. Uh, I mean, if you are currently in Montreal, that's good for you. I'm not, unfortunately. Uh, but um, uh, the twentieth Privacy uh, Enhancing Technology Symposium, which was supposed to be in Montreal this year, uh, is uh, uh, um, going to be virtual this year, as you all know. And um, for, um, for for a week, we're going to um, pretend that uh, we're all in this uh, um, amazing city. So anyway, I mean, for obvious uh, reasons, we're going to do uh, the best we can to, to bring you um, pets as uh, as much of a pet as as, uh, as is possible under the, the circumstances. All right. Um, so to open um, this uh, this event, um, every year pets is is a, is a journey from the previous pets to, to the next one. Right. So this year, um, me and Aaron had the task, uh, challenging task, to uh, bring this event from uh, the success of uh, Stockholm last year um, to Montreal. So that's a long journey, several thousand miles, and uh, we. Um, uh, we try to, to do our best for that. Um, so the journey starting, uh, the journey takes, takes um, uh, four issues, uh, four rounds, as you all know, uh, with new submissions um, in every round. So for the first one, we had 70 submissions and uh, 20 of them, uh, 12 of them were, were accepted. Uh, continuing with the um, uh, second issue, um, on which we had the record, uh, 97 submissions, out of which 26 uh, were accepted. And I think this was quite a, quite a milestone um, because for, for that round alone, we had actually more submissions than um, the PET 2014 had in total. So 2014 was the, the last year uh, in the previous uh, format. So before PET decided to go um, in a, in a journal-like uh, uh, style. And, and um, several years uh, later, I would say that, that this uh, can be declared a success because uh, pets uh, managed to, to, to grow a lot. All right, uh, one more issue, 83 more submissions, 16 um, of them were, were accepted. And at this point, we have just one more issue to go, right? So um, uh, I might say at this point that when, when I, I was asked to, uh, to chair uh, pets for 2019 and 2020, um, I mean, that, that, that's a challenging task, right? So a lot of things can go wrong. And I was thinking, you know, uh, what, what can go wrong and, uh, um, I mean, a lot of responsibility uh, and all that. But then at, at this point, seven issues, uh, three issues out of seven uh, of the one that I'm, I'm in charge are, are, are done. One more to go. Really, my, my job is almost over. I mean, I can see the end of the tunnel. So what can possibly go wrong, right? Right, of course. I mean, a pandemic, why not? Like it has to happen at that exact point. But what can we do? I mean, you have to move on. So uh, we moved on. And thankfully, people just kept on submitting uh, pets, 89 more submissions, 24 accepted. And after all that work, we managed to, to join uh, Jeremy and Sebastian, uh, well, not in Montreal as expected, but in virtual uh, Montreal. Um, and uh, must also say at this point that uh, Jeremy and Sebastian did uh, an amazing uh, work to, to make this happen which was not exactly what they signed up for. So thanks a lot to them for uh, making this, um, this possible. All right, so after all this work, we can uh, all put this in our, in our CV. We made it through and managed to organize this, uh, uh, this event. So that was, that was quite a journey. All right, so of course, um, this uh, cannot be done if you work alone. So we had a whole army. Uh, almost 1,000 authors, uh, 339 papers, um, more than 100 species members, a lot of external reviewers that submitted more than 1,000 reviews and several thousand comments to make this, this program. So uh, big thanks to, to all of them. This is really an amazing, uh, amazing work. Um, so to enjoy um, this week, the, the main thing you need to find is the event website. So if you haven't already, find this link. It's also accessible from... Um, so this is not the... The, the usual uh, petsymposium.org, but it's accessible uh, from that link, and it contains all the information you need um, to access um, the streams, all the information, the, the chats, everything. So make sure to, to find and bookmark um, this link. All right, so this is a program. So uh, we decided to stick to time zones that are accessible from, um, from Northern America and 
uh, Europe uh, mostly. Um, so uh, this means that um, the, the time slots we had uh, were, were not that many. And uh, we only have, um, so we had to stretch the program to, to several days and have um, parallel tracks. So every day there's a, uh, say, morning and afternoon track. Of course, this, these times are all EDT, but from the website, you can also find, uh, um, find it converted to other time zones. Um, so this is more or less the, the program. Uh, it's on the website. Make sure um, to, to find the talks you are interested in. And um, uh, at least um, uh, a nice thing of the virtual format is that it's, it's very easy to, to switch between, uh, between tracks. So uh, the fact that uh, all the tracks are, are multi-track um, uh, hopefully will not be that much of a problem. Uh, many thanks to all the people um, uh, who are chairing uh, sessions. Uh, these are the names, of course, they are um, available in, in the, the website. Um, so if you're a speaker, you have received uh, instructions, but of course, feel free also to contact these, these uh, people who will help you uh, with uh, anything you might need uh, for the talk. Make sure not to miss the keynote uh, talk uh, tomorrow at uh, 10 o'clock EDT by Michael Kearns about um, the ethical algorithm, the um, topic of a uh, recent book of his. Really looking forward to, um, to this talk, so make sure I miss it. Um, as of every year, we have the usual TED stuff. So town hall is Wednesday at um, 10.45. Um, so uh, make sure not to miss it. There is, uh, as always, very interesting discussion uh, about everything uh, related to um, uh, the pets uh, symposium. And uh, it's, it's quite important that the whole community uh, participates because I mean, this is uh, the moment where we, we get the feedback from everyone and, and try to um, uh, push this, this event forward. Uh, RAM session, as always, will take place on Thursday. Um, there's this link that you can register yourself for a short talk. Um, the link is available uh, on, on the website. So if you want to uh, give a short, say, uh, three to five minutes um, um, uh, short talk, uh, make sure to register yourself for, for the RAM session. Um, as usual, we have the Best Student Paper Award. Uh, this is um, for papers written primarily by a student uh, who is also presenting um, the work. So Nick Hopper is um, uh, taking care of, of this. And uh, if you feel like giving uh, him uh, feedback, uh, if you uh, found a talk that you, you think is exceptional by a student, um, uh, please go on and give feedback to, to Nick. Special, special, special uh, thanks to everyone who uh, helped um, uh, making uh, these pets um, a reality. Um, so, Kat and Rebecca uh, handled the publicity, uh, Ian and Kat, um, everything had to, be, to do with the web. Uh, Rachel and, and Stephen um, found the money. Uh, Vasilis and, and Tobias um, uh, took charge of the uh, final publications. Uh, Ryan Henry was um, um, handled the, the video, uh, which was uh, particularly important this, um, uh, this year. Uh, stipend, Roger, Emiliano, uh, Damon and Andre, uh, the Pet Award, Simone and Ross, Hot Pets, of course, uh, Walter and Michael, and uh, this year, the, the novelty that will be uh, discussed also in, in the town hall, uh, which is Artifacts, uh, chaired by Cecilia and, and Jack. Right. And of course, uh, many, many thanks, as I uh, already said, to Jeremy and Sebastian um, handled a job that they did not sign up for, and uh, uh, I think they did a wonderful job. Well, remains to, to be seen, but uh, that's my, uh, my impression. All right, so the only thing that is actually easier in a virtual conference is logistics. So lunches, dinner, coffee, you do whatever you want. We don't care, just don't make a mess. But don't forget to hang out. So we have two meeting points uh, using a very interesting uh, platform um, on which you can uh, move around and, and uh, get in proximity to, to people and start chatting uh, with them. So the meeting points, uh, you can find them in the, in the website. They're available the whole day for, for hanging out and chatting uh, with people. Uh, and um, last but not least, so um, uh, a very important thing for us is that pets remains um, an, an uh, enjoyable uh, event for everyone. So if uh, um, in, in, in any um, sense you feel threatened or harassed or uh, anything like that, so feel free. Uh, to contact and this email or uh, this, uh, this website, uh, Paul and Susan, who are uh, making sure that the pet remains a safe place. So that's it. Let the fun uh, begin. And uh, I'm handing it over to Jeremy for um, technical things that uh, he might want to, uh, to say.
All right, well, thanks, Costas. And uh, on behalf of the general chairs, uh, Sebastian and I, uh, welcome to PETS as well. Um, I will evict Costas from the screen sharing. Actually, yeah. And uh, I'll just show you a few quick things on the website. Uh, while I get this set up, uh, let me just say I'm in my basement on a laptop. Uh, and so this is the kind of uh, circumstances we're working from. So if, if things don't, don't go smoothly, uh, forgive us, but uh, I think uh, we have everything um, everything under control. Uh, okay, so, so hopefully by now, uh, by virtue of you having uh, found this video, uh, you found the website. If you ever get lost, you can always go back to the original uh, PETS website, and there's going to be lots of links throughout the program uh, to link you to the event site. Basically, the event site will be your uh, sort of portal for this week. Uh, and then if you ever want to go back and watch things that, that you've seen, you know, after PETS is over, then everything will be archived or, or various things will be archived on, on the uh, PETS website. So uh, the question and answer in the live streams will not be archived. Uh, however, uh, all the talks are pre-recorded and we'll, we'll have at least the ones from the authors that gave us our consent uh, to put them on the website. They'll be on the website within maybe a month or so after the conference. Um, one quick thing just to keep in mind is make sure that you're always logged in. Uh, so if you're trying to access something and there's no button and you think there should be a button there, uh, the, the most likely scenario is that you're actually not logged in. Uh, so a lot of the program is actually public. So you can just check up in the uh, top right hand uh, corner and, and you can uh, see that, that you're logged in at all times. Uh, and then uh, when you jump into a session, so this session is going to turn into track A. Uh, so track A is, is anonymous communication. Uh, if, if you're looking for track B or C, when I'm done talking, you can uh, jump over uh, to those two tracks. Uh, but, but anyways, uh, at the very bottom, you'll see the YouTube link, first of all, at the top. And then at the very bottom, there's a discussion form. So this is where you can ask your questions uh, to the authors. Uh, you're also invited to join the Zoom call. So we're on Zoom right now. Uh, long story about why we're using Zoom. It wasn't our, our first choice, but uh, you can ask me about that in the hallway track. Uh, but, but anyways, uh, if, you, if you ever want to, usually in the YouTube description, uh, there's going to be a link uh, to the actual Zoom call. And so you can ask your question in person uh, as well. And if anything happens, the YouTube stream you know, goes down or people go offline, I don't know, worst case scenario, you can always uh, join the, the web conference call as well. So that's sort of the fallback uh, kind of position. Okay, so, so that's mainly what I want to say. Uh, uh, Casas thanked uh, basically all the PETS people. Uh, and so thank you for that. I I'll also add my thanks to all of them. Uh, in addition, I'd like to thank uh, the people at Concordia uh, who, who did a lot of uh, the work on this. So in particular, Marie France, Jessica and, and Maria uh, from Hospitality uh, Concordia. We had other people from IITS and, and other places as well, uh, which I, I thank as well. So. Uh, that's it for me. And so what will happen now is we'll go into track A uh, here on this stream. And if you're looking for track B or C, uh, just look below in the YouTube links uh, in the YouTube description and, and you can jump over or you can always go back to the event website as well. OK, so we'll, we'll maybe give people about 30 seconds to get settled and, and then we'll go ahead and start with track A here. So thank you. Enjoy the conference.